Prairie disease is a condition that affects uh, penile uh, layers called tunic albuginia uh, and allow them to deform and thicken uh, and that will lead to curvatures in the penis. There are multiple theories uh, that can lead to a peroneal disease such as uh, multiple trauma, uh, genetics uh, diseases, as well as idiopathic. Peroneal disease can actually negatively impact erectile uh, function in men uh, because of the curvature and angulation of the penile, not to be able to uh, perform having pain during, during sexual activities as well as uh, able to, able to, to, to penetrate uh, during intercourse. It's diagnosed by physical examination. Uh, oftentimes, patient will report uh, having a, a difficult angulation in the penis, deformities in the penis. We do actually do a, a, a very thorough examination in the office, uh, which involve uh, getting erections in the office and taking some pictures, as well as some measurements in the office. Uh, when you see a specialist like myself, as well as doing some x-rays, uh, which include penile ultrasounds to establish the location of these uh, deformities within the penile tissue. There are medical therapies, uh, as well as traction therapies, and also there are procedures that can uh, be uh, um, you know, discussed with the specialist uh, to correct the curvatures. For medical therapies, there are uh, oral therapies as well as injectable therapies, something called Zyaflex or collagenase injections. And there's also penile traction devices. Uh, and lastly, as I mentioned, there are procedures we can do to correct the curvatures in the penis. Depending on the severity of the penile uh, curvature uh, and the deformity that uh, occurred with peroneal disease, we design a treatment plan that addresses all these issues. If patient has ED uh, as well as peroneal disease, that can be really complex and you need, need a, a thorough evaluation and treatment for those patients. If uh, peroneal disease is left untreated, uh, that can lead to uh, multiple conditions. Uh, it can lead to deformities, uh, narrowing constrictions in the penis, uh, also shortening of the penis, as well as erectile dysfunction. Uh, 